In the emotional finale of Agatha All Along, episodes 8 and 9 bring the show's complicated storylines to a dramatic and meaningful end. Agatha Billy and Jennifer face their final challenges on the witch's road, discovering secrets and shaping their futures. In this breakdown, we'll look at the character developments, main themes, and the lasting effects these final episodes bring to the MCU. But this can't be the end. It has to be the beginning. I finally broke the curse. I, mean, I can really do something with my life now. You're a protection witch. Yeah. You died protecting someone. Episode 8 starts with Agatha agreeing to give Billy to Rio, who sees him as an abomination for getting a second life. This deal highlights Agatha's inner struggle and conflicting loyalties. Agatha's choice to sacrifice Billy shows her complicated nature. Throughout the series, she has shifted between being a villain and showing vulnerability, making her motivations both interesting and unclear. By presenting Billy as a pawn in her conflict with Rio, the episode encourages us to think about the nature of sacrifice and the tough choices that come up in relationships influenced by love and power. As the characters travel the witch's road, they realize that it loops back on itself, serving as a powerful symbol of the cycles of life, death, and unresolved trauma. This circular path represents the characters' inability to escape their pasts. It emphasizes that growth often requires revisiting old wounds and facing lingering fears. The visual representation of the road invites us to think about our own life experiences and the necessity of confronting one's past. When Billy puts his shoes back on, it shows his readiness to deal with the complexities of his identity. This action signifies acceptance of his journey, recognizing the challenges he faces while also hinting at his growth and resilience. It is a touching moment that reinforces the theme of choice as he decides to confront his reality rather than remain passive. Jen's journey takes a major turn when she discovers that Agatha was the witch who bound her. Performing the unbinding spell marks a significant moment of empowerment for Jen, showing her growth from being a victim to taking charge of her own life. Jen's reclaiming of her powers symbolizes her control over her own story. This moment reflects her strength and highlights the importance of personal choice in overcoming obstacles. As Jin leaves after getting what she needs, like the road promised, this act of departure emphasizes her personal growth and the significance of self-discovery. In a world filled with manipulation and constraints, Jin's escape marks a victory against external control, stressing the need for all of us to carve our own paths. Agatha helps Billy find Tommy's soul an act that showcases their strong emotional bond. Billy's choice to place Tommy's soul into the body of a drowning boy is a touching exploration of sacrifice and compassion. This moment highlights the emotional impact of family ties and the lengths one will go to protect loved ones. Billy's willingness to save his brother shows his maturity and understanding of the complexities of life and death. This act reflects a deep sense of empathy and responsibility, showing his growth from a boy who has faced loss to a young man ready to confront the consequences of his choices. The act of transferring Tommy's soul symbolizes the connectedness of their fates. Billy's journey is not just about personal redemption, but also about preserving the family ties that bind him. This theme reinforces the idea that love often requires sacrifice, suggesting that genuine connections are worth the struggles they entail. Agatha's journey culminates in her ability to grow a flower through a crack in the floor using a seed from her locket. This act symbolizes new beginnings after hardship. The flower represents hope and resilience. It signifies that beauty can emerge from darkness and that people can find redemption even after making questionable choices. Agatha's success in this trial shows her acceptance of her past while embracing the possibility of a different future. The dynamics between Agatha and Rio add complexity to her journey. When Agatha tries to give Billy up but is convinced to sacrifice herself instead, it highlights her growth and change. Agatha's choice to accept her fate shows her acknowledgement of the consequences of her past actions, marking a significant step in her character development. It portrays her as a multi-dimensional character capable of deep love and sacrifice, ultimately seeking redemption through selflessness. After Agatha's death, Billy goes home and notices objects that remind him of the road. It turns out that Billy, like his mother, created a pocket universe. Given that Wanda possessed chaos magic, which allowed her to reshape reality at will, 
It stands to reason that her son also possesses these abilities. This explains how Billy was able to create the witch's road. Everything Billy needed to find Tommy was already inside him. Yet he needed a physical manifestation of this to see it through. Thus the witch's road was born from his chaos magic powers, formulating a physical series of trials and tribulations for him and the rest of the witches to overcome. The season finale dives into Agatha's backstory, revealing her tragic past and the driving forces behind her actions throughout the series. This episode serves as a culmination of character development, thematic exploration, and emotional resonance, providing closure while setting the stage for future possibilities. The episode starts in 1750, showing Agatha giving birth to Nicholas. The ominous presence of death warns her that she will eventually take her son, establishing a tragic tone that runs throughout the episode. Agatha's first experience as a mother shows her vulnerability and emotional depth. The warning from death hints at the tragedy that will shape her character, laying the groundwork for her future choices. This contrast of maternal love and impending loss is a powerful comment on the sacrifices parents make for their children and the deep grief that often comes with such bonds. As Agatha raises Nicholas, she begins absorbing the powers of other witches. This act of taking their magic reflects her desire for power but also her growing isolation. Agatha's actions show a desperate need to regain control after losing her son. Absorbing other witches' powers symbolizes her attempt to fill the emptiness left by Nicholas's death, revealing her deep fears and insecurities. The moral implications of her actions highlight the darkness that often comes with a quest for power, suggesting that the pursuit of strength can lead to loneliness and corruption. The song that Agatha and Nicholas create serves as a poignant reminder of their bond. It contrasts the innocence of childhood with the darkness that will define Agatha's life. The song becomes a symbol of her lost innocence and the joy that was taken from her, further emphasizing the tragic aspects of her character. Nicholas's illness and subsequent death at the hands of death deeply impact Agatha, pushing her into a path of revenge and despair. Nicholas's death marks a significant turning point for Agatha, turning her grief into a relentless pursuit of power. Losing him signifies the end of her innocence and the start of her moral decline. This key event shows how profound loss can shape a person's journey, often leading them to darker paths in their quest for meaning and connection. With nothing left to hold her back, Agatha's centuries-long quest to absorb other witches' magic becomes a manifestation of her grief and anger. Her methods, tricking witches into opening the road and pushing them to attack her, reveal her bitterness and desire for revenge against the world that took Nicholas from her. This cycle of manipulation and betrayal reinforces the idea that grief can turn into a consuming darkness, changing one's very nature. In the present, Billy learns that he created the road, which leads him to blame himself for the deaths of Lilia, Alice, and Sharon. This moment captures the theme of guilt and its heavy burden. Billy's despair reflects the heavy load of responsibility that often comes with loss. His belief that he is to blame for the deaths shows how trauma can twist one's view of reality. Agatha's reassurance that she would have killed them anyway adds complexity to his self-blame, emphasizing that sometimes events are out of our control. Agatha's role in this moment acts as a reflection of Billy's struggles. She represents the darker sides of grief and loss, showing him the potential paths he could take if consumed by guilt. This dynamic between them highlights the importance of facing one's past rather than giving in to it, suggesting that redemption is possible even after tragedy. As Billy tries to banish Agatha, she reveals her fear of dying because she cannot face Nicholas. This moment explores regret and the fear of facing one's past. Agatha's admission highlights the burden of unresolved grief and the fear of what lies beyond death. Her unresolved relationship with Nicholas symbolizes her struggle to face the consequences of her actions. This theme resonates deeply, suggesting that true redemption necessitates confronting the uncomfortable truths we often avoid. Billy's decision to allow Agatha to remain as a ghost marks a pivotal moment of compassion and understanding. Rather than seeking to rid himself of her, he recognizes her as a guide on his journey toward redemption. This act of kindness illustrates the power of connection in the face of darkness, implying that healing often arises from embracing rather than rejecting the past. 
The episode concludes with Billy and Agatha embarking on a quest to find Tommy. As they close the door of the road and note the names of Sharon, Alice, and Lilia, this act signifies a symbolic transition for both characters. This partnership reflects a significant shift in Agatha's character. By assuming the role of a mentor for Billy, she transforms from a manipulative figure into one of guidance, suggesting that even the darkest characters have the potential for growth and change. Their shared commitment to confront their pasts and seek redemption highlight the importance of solidarity in the journey of healing. The closing of the road signifies not only the end of a cycle, but also the promise of new beginnings. As they set out to find Tommy, the episode instills a sense of hope, implying that despite the darkness they have encountered, the possibility for light and resolution still exists.